Tonight, officials at one San Jose middle school want to ditch its controversial name. It bears the symbol of a former racist state leader. KPIX 5's Marie Medina is at Peter Burnett Middle School, where some say it's about time. The school was named after Peter Burnett, California's first ever governor. He was sworn in right here in San Jose in 1849. He fought to keep African Americans and Native Americans out of our state. He was a jack. He was a racist guy. When Petra Pino moved to California years ago, she did her research on the state's first governor. He didn't want to have black people in the area. He did what he could to get to um, take Native Americans and, you know, destroy their homes and destroy their livelihood and, you know, do them off as well. And in walking distance from her home is a middle school named after that governor, Peter Burnett. Does it make you wonder why a school was even named after him? Um, I can imagine why. You know, there was this fantasy of this of this Wild West when that school was probably named. But now the San Jose Unified School District staff is working to change the middle school's name, asking on its website for suggestions. On the district's Facebook page, a Burnett language arts and social studies teacher wrote about Burnett's history of pushing for the exclusion of African Americans, advocating the extermination of Native Americans, and supporting the Chinese Exclusion Act. The teacher who wondered who Peter Burnett that was wrote the answer to that question has been disturbing the legacy of Burnett sharply conflicts with the values we hold now they're doing their job right and I mean they're doing research doing critical thinking yeah. not only do neighbors agree I think we could find somebody uh, more positive and you know uh, maybe connected to San Jose so does this Burnett student I'm glad they're changing it some say it's about time in 2015 a Long Beach elementary school also named after Burnett voted to change it I think it's awesome. I'd be happy to put in a couple suggestions, so that's great to hear. What would be your suggestion? I don't know. I need to think about that a little. <laughs> and school leaders are asking for suggestions until March 11th. We reached out to the district spokesperson, but have yet to hear back. In San Jose, Maria Medina, KPIX 5.